My name is Astra, I'm 35 years old and my profession is to be a primary teacher. I've always loved children and when I met Sebastian we decided very soon that we wanted to have a family. It was quite challenging because we both had very stressful work jobs. So we tried for a year and a half and we, we didn't succeed in having children. So we decided to go to EV to see if there was any problems with us. EV was conceived in 1989. I suddenly realized that the support that our specialty got in public medicine was not sufficient. The reason why we created so many clinics is that we started to have many patients from uh, outside of Valencia and also from abroad. The international department started here in Valencia and the reason was basically because we started to receive patients from Germany. Today we have patients not only from Germany but also from the rest of Europe and many places of the world. So we need a huge international department because patients feel more comfortable if they find somebody who speaks their language. The treatment was fantastic. We started seeing doctors and they were really, really helpful because obviously women always think that it's their problem and they for sure put you together with your couple. If it's a problem, it's both problems. So it's really good the connection that you have with the doctors. Who we trust was the people in Evie. So if we had any problems or any issues, we always went to them and we always found somebody to help us. In the in vitro lab really is the heart of the clinic. She is the very center, the focus of the, of the work is made in the IVF lab. It's where you can make difference from one clinic to another clinic. It's the place, it's the room where the fertilization or the fecundation take place. It's the secret of the reproductive medicine area. The Embryoscope is a device that was developed together with a Danish company. It allows to culture the embryo for three days without any intervention out of the incubator. The beauty of the Embryoscope is that it's recording every single second the embryos. In this way, we are able to get an increase of about 15 to 20 percent in overall pregnancy rates. AV was pioneer during the last 20 years in so many areas. We are pioneers in vitrification. One of our major achievements was the development for the first time in the world of an egg bank. We can analyze the donors after donation, so there is a kind of a quarantine. We didn't have that in the past, only for sperm, but not for eggs. Also, we were the first uh, doing pre-implantation diagnosis just to prevent the transmission of some illness from the parents to the children. During the last 20 years, we were the first in so many things. The foundation has been of paramount importance for us. We perform all our research, the clinical research here at EVE in the clinic, but the basic science mostly in the university laboratories. And that is why EVE Foundation makes EVE different from another clinic. The foundation has also a social commitment and is developing programs to help people. EV is uh, perceived uh, today as one of the world uh, leaders in, in our field. 
for three main reasons. Number one, the number of patients that we treat. Number two, because we are established in many parts of the world. And probably uh, what is also unique in our organization is the fact that being a private center, we have been able to successfully develop a, a research program. For this reason, we firmly believe that we are one of the groups in the world with the best treatment outcomes for our patients. When I look at Chloe and I, I look at her and how long it took us to have her, and I see her and she's so made for us. Obviously being a teacher, I always wanted to have children and bring up children, and now I'm mother of two lovely children. And, and I decided to leave my job until they grow up because I love it so much. One of the biggest satisfaction that we have is the day that we can help the women to get pregnant. Once you, you get the, the child, they, they bring us the baby just to, to share with us the happiness. In that moment, you feel part of the family.